get your hands off me. What have you done to her? Take that, you bastard. I will shoot you in the face. Oh. Hi, amigos. This is a different video. Obviously, this doesn't look like RimWorld. Why in the world does this look so different? It's because we're not playing RimWorld. We're actually playing The Evil Within 2. It's a game I've been wanting to play. I didn't actually play The Evil Within 1. I watched a, a little bit of the playthroughs for it, and it didn't really seem that interesting to me, so I kind of gave it a pass. I mean, it was very Resident Evil 4, and I liked Resident Evil 4, but this looks interesting. Let's play it, um, and let's see what we got. Uh, and um, if we like it, and uh, and if you like it, then maybe we'll do more. Okay, here we go. You ready? Oh my god, I'm ready. Okay, home engulfed in flames. Tragic fire kills child and nanny. Oh man, oh man, come on, what was the nanny doing? Smoking on the job, probably. That's why. It's a cigarette. A cigarette started the fire, and the nanny fell asleep, and her hair caught on fire, and, and now the whole house is burning up, and... Damn it, I'm, I'm never, I'm never going with, a uh, $2 childcare again. Just, you know, we'll rate them down. Holy shit. No. No. No, this is not happening! No. Hello? Hello? Somebody? Neighbors? Can somebody call the fire department, please? My house is burning down. I think my daughter is in there too. Hello? Can somebody... Hello? Hello? Okay, okay, there's nobody there. Okay, maybe... Okay, I guess we gotta go do it. Man, the fire does look good, doesn't it? Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Let's just stand and, and bask in the warmth. Okay. Uh... Do we have a... Oh, oh God, shit. Lily! Oh God, Lily! That's, oh, that's right, my daughter's in there. Ha! Ah, okay, let's go inside. Open the door. Ooh. Get back. Watch out. Flames are dangerous. Um, you know what? <coughs> Excuse me. Let's, um... Can we kick it down with our foot? Hello? Oh. Maybe not? No? Okay, let's go over here. Ah, a glass door. Perfect. Damn it! Yeah, damn it. Can't open that either. Oh, there we go. Smash. Let's go. Lily, I'm Hello? here. Hello. Where are you? I'm here. Oh God, is she upstairs? Oh, is she upstairs? I know. Whoa. Oh my God. I hope insurance is gonna pay for that. Okay, come on, let's go. Lily, I'm coming. Baby, I'm coming. Where the hell is the damn nanny? Where? Is she been smoking again? Damn it, I knew it. I knew the smoking was going to be bad. Happen? I told my wife. I, 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 I figured it was the smoking and the cigarettes, and I told her. Oh my god. I hope she, she just died in that. I hope she was in there, because I am not paying her a single cent for this shit. She just set my fucking house on fire. Alright. Let's go. <coughs> I'm coming, I'm Lily. coming, sweetie. Just oh. hold on. I'm coming. Just, just, just go into the bathroom. I saw a movie once where they stuck a tube here, inside Lily. of the toilet. I'm here. And, uh, and, and they could breathe air. So just, 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 just hold on. Let's crouch. Let's not get burned. God, it's so hot in here. I mean, like, if I was here, right, then I would probably, um, I'd probably just be dying and, and it would, it would be nuts. Is anybody in here? Hello? Are you in there? No? Unlock the door, babe! Oh, it's locked. Okay. I guess not. Okay. No? Are you hiding in the in here? No? Maybe? What is this? Man. I, uh... God, this is scary. Actually, you know what? My house was on fire once. And it was... It was scary as hell. Um, because we came home and there was smoke coming out of the window. Uh, but we were able to call 911. I can't believe I haven't, like, pulled my cell phone out yet. Lily? Okay, Lily. Where are you? I'm here. Daddy's here. Come on Where out. are you? Lily! Oh, look at my Where face. Where are you? I'm here. Dad's here. I'm here. Where You're are you? You're here for me, Dad. No, that's what the nanny was for. Why didn't she call 911? Oh, look. 
Oh, daddy's here. I'm here. Come to daddy. Oh. Oh, shit. No. Oh my god. Everything's going crazy. I'm catching on fire. This is not how it's supposed to be. Oh, look. Here I am. The Tango Whiskey. Old Rye. Favorite place. Oh, too many drinks. He looks a bit like Keanu Reeves, doesn't he? Who are you? Kidman? Hello, Sebastian. It's been a long time. Three years. I've been trying to track you down for three years. And you thought you'd find me at the bottom of an empty bottle. Is that it? Yeah. And why well, you are know you I here like, now, I like damn my it. whiskey? You didn't find me because they didn't want you to. Calm down, Sebastian. You knew what was going to happen in that hospital, didn't you? What happened at Beacon is in the past. You need to forget it. But you I sound can't, just like Kidman. That psychologist that forced shoved down my throat. That's right. But he didn't have answers. You do. That's You're right, going to tell Kidman. me about Mobius. Oh, what? <laughs> Agent Smith. Hello, Mr. Anderson. Welcome back. I'm here because of this. Ooh, what is that? What's well, my family? How did she get that photo? Where did you get this? That's right, bitch. You've been going Billy's through my still stuff. Alive. Lily is dead! I read the police report! I was at her funeral! We can rewrite history if we want to. Staging a death is child's play. Yeah. What? Why would I come out of the shadows just to lie to you? I don't know. Lily is alive. And she's with us. But she's in danger. We need you to help save her. What did you do? Save her? What have you done to her? What have you done to her? Man, Get imagine if, like, off me. this was Arnold Schwarzenegger. Get your hands off me! What have you done to her? Take that, you bastard! I will shoot you in the face! Oh. I was hoping you'd come willingly, Sebastian. But we don't have time for this bullshit. Damn it! Damn it, Kidman! Uh, 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 I'm falling down! Uh. Lily needs you. God, they really are like agents, aren't they? Oh, that's it. Well, I guess I'm dead now. Or no. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. Oh. You're awake. Good. Yeah. Great. Where are we? You're in one of our facilities. So this is the almighty Mobius, huh? Oh, this is cool. Be careful about what you say. You don't know how powerful they are. Right. So powerful they have to kidnap a washed up ex-cop to help them. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> At least your terrible sense of humor is still intact. Enough of this bullshit. I make people laugh Where's at the bar. Patience. All your answers are right here. Whoa. This is... Actually, some major The Beacon shit. Mental Hospital incident was an unfortunate setback. But we used the knowledge gained to build a new and vastly improved Hello? STEM system. Hello? What does this have to do with my daughter? Imagine it. Millions of minds connected together. Happiness for one is happiness for all. This machine, this miracle, will allow our species to achieve greatness. Greatness. We needed to start with a mind that was pure and clean enough to support thousands of personalities. 
the mind of an oh innocent my, child. Oh, she's in there. Oh my god. My daughter. You connected Lily to that machine? Yeah, Ugh. fuck you, man. Your daughter is quite special. The most stable core candidate we've ever tested. Man, what's up with this guy? Thanks like to her, the new Rubble STEM voice. has been a smashing success. Whoa. Until recently. Am I playing Half-Life 2? <laughs> A little over this a Half Life ago, Three, maybe. Lily vanished. My name is actually Gordon Just Freeman. Stop sending Stop signals. calling me Sebastian. Then the STEM environment began to collapse. Remember that we intro? It was just a technical glitch, an easy fix. So we sent a team of Mobius agents inside. But then we lost contact with them, and STEM went dark. Think about this, Mr. Castellanos. I am providing you an opportunity. Not only to see your daughter again, but to save her life. Something you thought you failed to do before. Why you blame me like this? You can save her, or let her die. It's your choice. Don't make me choose. Why? Okay, well, we're in the bathtub. Here we go. Good luck, Sebastian. And please, try to cooperate with any team members you might find in there. I know you don't trust us. I don't. But they have the same goals as you do. That's sure. all right. I'm fine by myself. I'm fine by myself. Just remember to call me the moment you find Lily, so that we can begin the extraction process. I'll be out here for you. Okay. Can you give me a shave, too? While I'm at it, please? God, it's been days since I've seen a razor. And someone else will be in there for you. What does that Are mean? Are you ready? Man, he, that guy is like, pure, like, typical, like, bad guy G-Man, isn't he? He's just like... Be careful, we're here for Sebastian. You. We're here to take kidnap your children. Out. We've also high, we're the per people who set your house on fire because we actually provided the nanny with the cigarettes. <laughs> Man, that wouldn't that be crazy Stand though? If like the three, nanny was like on orders two, to set the house on fire? Oh shit! One. Maybe they were. Whoa! Oh shit, oh god, oh god. Ah, 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 I'm falling. Oh my god. Oh, oh god, I'm turning upside down. Oh god. Oh, somebody help me. I'm falling. Oh god. Help me. Somebody please. Oh, what the fuck? It's now I have signed up. Oh. Okay. I like this VR experience, Kidman. Very immersive. Man, what if VR was like this though, man? Like you sat down and then like, you know, you, you, you get in and you just start falling and then you're like in the game and then when you wake up you're in a bathtub. I mean, that's that's pretty good. I, that's that's uh it's real interesting, right? But actually, think about it, like how cool would that be, right? If you just fell in and then you're in there and you're in the lobby and everybody's like teabagging each other and like crawling all over the ground and stuff, like in PUBG or something. Is this... Where am I? Consume stamina? Let's try it. Let's run. Oh, it's like... It's like, um... Assassin's Creed, right? Oh, it's my house. Oh god, I don't need to be reminded of this again. Oh, that nanny. I will kill her if she didn't blow up already. Let's go. Oh god! Dad, there it goes. I'm coming, Lily! There goes all the... Gasoline we store, just in case. Shit. Oh. I know it's, it's hard to accept Myra, but she's gone. Our little girl is gone. No, no, no. I'll never accept it. If you won't help me, I'll find out the truth on my own. What the hell is this place? What? Good questions. Okay, let's keep running. Dun, dun. 
To attack, press X. To do a strong attack, press, press Y. To jump, press A. Whoa, what? What the fuck was that? What's going on? Hello? Oh, God. Oh! Detective, we've got a call. Oh. Yeah, it's Beacon. Remember this from the old game? Do you remember? This is like where everything went down. Ooh. A desk? Is that a phone? Hello? Just talk to me. Hello? Is there a phone over there? Let's go. There it is. Oh man, hopefully they gave me like... What is this? Dun -dun. Pick up the phone. Okay, hello? Oh, oh my gosh. Just pick up the phone, Sebastian. What Whoa. Hey, it's the main menu screen. We're back. We did it. Hello? Sebastian, are you there? Hello, I would like to order a, a big Domino's pizza, please, what? with extra cheese it, and uh, pepperoni. Hello? How are you feeling? Terrible. Like the worst hangover ever. Don't worry. It will pass once your mind has adjusted. You're in an area separate from the main system right now. That's how we're able to maintain communication with you. This construct is called your room. Sure. It's a safe zone that was formed from your own memories. My memories, It's huh? a safe space, you guys. It's a safe if space. If that's the case, then where are my wife and child? Oh, look. This place Daddy. looks like my old office at Crimson City PD. Crimson City PD. That built it. Crimson you University? That okay. Question. Let's get down to business. Sebastian Castellanos. A lot. I've never seen any of this before in my life, Kidman. Oh. Daddy! Lily drew this picture of me. It was burned up along with everything else in the house. Oh, look. There I am. Uh, from Crimson University, the uh, prestigious online university. Um, I got my uh, degree in detective arts and... Uh, can I read that? Man. No, I can't. Can you see it? No? Okay, what, what do I have? My first commendation. Feels like another lifetime. I guess because it was. Of course, working for uh, the online police agency as well. Um, cool. What the fuck is this? What is this? There are photos of a bunch of Mobius agents here. Your lost team, I assume. That's them. Let us know if you locate any of them. Interesting. You're our only line of communication into STEM. They're stuck in Union and searching for Lily too. Union? Union. Union. This what STEM is that? environment was designed to look and feel like a small town called Union. Oh, that's cool. Great. So your experts need rescuing too, huh? If anyone can do it, it's you. Thanks for the vote of confidence, but I'm only here to find Lily. There's more info there. You should check it out before you go. Cool, okay. So, we're here to find Lily, uh, and we're also probably going to find um, these guys. We have William Baker, okay? Uh, age 39. He's uh, 192 pounds, brown, blue. He likes... Um, combat specialist training, tactical planning, and probably likes watching The Bachelorette with his wife or something like that. Okay, and then Miles Harrison, uh, another man, 37. Um, he's shaved head. He's a closet racist, um, and so is probably Liam O'Neill. Actually, no, maybe he's more of like a, he looks like a tech nerdy guy, you know. What is he doing? Equipment fabrication, logistics. Okay, Julian Sykes, um, he hates Miles Harrison because he's a racist. Um, and Yukiko Hoffman, married, uh, a, a white man and um, uh, and uh, uh, now lives in the United States. What is that? Lily, your team, and now me. Oh We're yeah. We're all stuck inside STEM. Oh, I know this. Okay. I still oh, don't I can understand skip. why you. Can't. Okay, I don't want to talk to you about this. Okay. Investigate, man. This this logo is so interesting too. I feel like I'm part of some kind of workers' union. You know, like that could be like a hammer and sickle type thing. Like, you know, Mobius is like the workers' union for all. The people who, you know, get st stuck in 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 Union, uh, virtual huh? spaces or something. It looks like any town USA. It was designed that way to keep the test subjects calm and relaxed. Is that where I'm gonna go? Calm and relaxed. The exact opposite of Beacon. What happened at Beacon was beyond our control. It doesn't seem like you've got much control this time either. Look, I don't know what you're going to encounter in there. If you need information, I'd suggest you try talking to some of the locals. Locals. You know, canvas the area, just like you taught me back at KCPD. Wait a minute, so you there are like people a in real here? Detective Kidman. And you're not a detective anymore. Ooh. But let's try to do some detecting anyway. Sick okay? burn, Kidman. 
Okay, sick burn. She burned me. Okay, we, we she got me. Uh, we gotta get out of here. So let's open the door. Here we go. Okay, uh, walk through. Yeah, this is really great. Um, okay. Can I sit down at the computer? Hello? What have you got hiding in here? Oh, that's right, it's mine. <laughs> I guess technically it's all like mine. Oh, a cat. cat. I don't ever remember owning a cat. Hello, kitty. We will call you Mr. Bigglesworth. That's right. Mr. Bigglesworth? Meow. Okay, what do you got here, Mr. Bigglesworth? What's that? Slide projector. Oh my god. Where did my memory dig this up? Elementary school? It's a slide projector. A photographic slide. A relic from a pre-phone camera era. These are found mostly in people's attics and estate sales. They can be viewed using the slide projector in Sebastian's room. Well, that's cool. Remember these? Remember these back in school? Uh, I used them um, probably like right when they started phasing them out. Um, and then we had like overhead projectors for a while. And then like people tried all kinds of crazy things with whiteboards and... Oh, I can change slides. Oh, happy family. Look at that. Man. I wonder if I can like up the textures or something. I don't know. I'm like not running the best computer. I'm running a 950 right now if you if you really want to know. And yeah, you can look down on me, but uh, you know, I can play the game. So, and it looks great. Honestly, it looks pretty good. Okay, what else? What else is there? There's a cat, Mr. Bigglesworth. Great. Um there's some stuff. I can can I look at this? No. What's here? Nothing. Okay. Computers that don't work. What was the point of me thinking of computer? Oh shit! A mirror, just like Beacon. A mirror, just like Should Beacon. Should be a way out. Should be a way out. I love this guy's voice. It's so, doors. it's so grovelly, man. It's just like, my name is Sebastian Gastellanos, and I am a grizzly son of a bitch. I look like Keanu Reeves. I might as well be. What if he was played by Keanu Reeves, man? Oh, that would be awesome. Oh, what's that? What's this? Save terminals. Save terminals can be used to save your progress at any time. They can be found in safe houses in Sebastian's room. Okay, well that's cool. Great. Uh, I imagine we'll be using these. You know what I do miss? I do miss um, save points like this, where you can only save in some places. And some people hate that because they're like, they want to end their gameplay or whatever, but I think it's really cool. Okay, let's investigate. Let's go into the mirror. Uh, remember, um, in the last one, we had mirrors that you could look into, and you can transport in between like uh, places. Um, to save and, and stuff. So I wonder if like this room is like that. There's like nothing. There's like no creepy nurse in this one So maybe mr. Bigglesworth will like he'll like give me a syringe and say Well, hello. I have a syringe that you can inject into your brain and uh, we'll upgrade we your powers Now into the looking glass. That'll be $59 per injection Will my will my uh insurance cover this no you're fucked uh, especially with the new US laws um, we're not subsidized or anything like that so oh, that's my daughter oh it was a dream hey honey it was oh, just no. a dream I had this crazy dream that my house was on fire really what's wrong come here are you gonna blow up in my face again my doll's head is broke it's okay. Oh, it is. Mom can fix it for you. What have you done? She can fix anything. Oh, look at she's so happy. Hey, babe, come here. I want to tell you about a crazy dream I had. You know? Did you know that that babysitter? I think we should fire her because she's. You know how she smokes? I really just hate the smoking, and I told you that I don't like it. What's wrong? It's the smoke. Are it's making crazy? me dizzy. I've got a wonderful family, an amazingly smart and beautiful wife. Oof. Why wouldn't I be all right? You know what? I I take back up the shave bit. I Come think here, I think I'd rather him have some kind of stubble. I'm not. I mean, maybe in real life he might be. Too hard. <clears throat> it's he might be delirious. More handsome or something. Actually, you, you know sure what he looks like. Coming down with something. There's something kind of Johnny Cash about him, right? Or is that just me? Maybe John Wayne? You think it looks like John Wayne? <sighs> okay. Oh! Here we are. We're in the game. 
Man, how long have we been playing? It's been kind of a while, right? Is this the right place? Is this the right place? Man, maybe we'll have to like split this up into like two videos or something. Okay, well, uh... Well... I guess we didn't really get into gameplay. I actually have to go to work. So maybe... Maybe we should leave the actual gameplay for later. Sorry we didn't get so far. Um, but I have to get out of here. Um, stick around, we're gonna have a part two. Uh, which I will have to record later. But um, in the meantime, the game is saved. And uh, we'll be back. We'll be back with Sebastian Castellanos next time in the video. Thank you, and stay tuned. Peace.